seems rather peculiar. I've never been on a competition before. Guys, icebreakers is a relative term for a way of bonding for two people that have never met. Wow, this water seems almost near freezing. My approximate calculation would be 33 degrees Fahrenheit. Science rolls! Arms! Yeah, guys, if you studied object anatomy, you would know that the objects die within an hour of being out of our atmosphere. Test tube. Paintbrush insists that you build the rocket due to the limitations of its prejudiced mind. So try your best, but I mean, you know, it's alright if you don't, you know, you slip up the list. What? How did you find my secret laboratory? You actually have a secret lab? Of course she does! She's a stupid scientist! And proud! Well, now that you're here, please just follow the science rules! Rule number one, don't touch anything. Hey, don't! Stop it! No! You'll contaminate the experiment! What will it take for you to stop acting like five-year-olds? Actually, science has proven that pools contain approximately 30 different types of bacteria due to bathers introducing things to the pool like sunscreen, sweat, saliva, mucus, antioxidants. Oh, just thought you'd like to know. This was way too much. Okay, nobody's ever allowed in my laboratory ever again. What laboratory? Um, <laughs> Yeah, pizza can harbor dangerous bacteria like E. coli, staphylococcus. Hey, test tube. Yeah? Shut up. <laughs> oh, hey, are you here to see the waning crescent out tonight? The what? The old moon phase, of course. Looks small from here, but it actually has a diameter of 3,747 kilometers across. Yeah, I'm a teensy weensy bit awkward, too. <laughs> Child's play. Gravity would never allow such a catastrophic event. How fallacious! There's obviously some gravity-bending black hole nearby. Fascinating! A ghost! But wait, a ghost? That means I was wrong. And if I'm wrong now, then it's quite possible that everything I've ever studied has been false! I... I can't believe it. How? I... Why? Why? How long do you think it'll be before she shatters again? I'd say quicker than a catalyst helps reactants reach activation energy. Yes! Gotcha! Yay! <laughs> Phew! Close one! Test tube! Words can't describe how grateful I am right now. Thank goodness Test Tube was there for me. Luckily, I'm prepared for any technological disaster with my trusty bag of rice! Muzzle tub! <laughs> fan! You said that would work! Can you believe it, Fan? We're going to see Meeple Headquarters. Wowie golly whiz. Ew, you're a Meeple fan too? He said no. On it. <laughs> Don't forget the wire. I brought it just for him. Oh, um, sure. Just what the doctor ordered. I'm cured of my condition. Um, um, uh, uh, actually, it's known as a condition. Oh, no problem. Staying away from other people is my specialty. You can count on me. Ah, jeepers. It sure was nice of Fan to entrust me with his egg. Isn't that right, Egg? Yeah, just do. It was a great gesture. Ha, ha, ha. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. You better be more careful, mister. <laughs> You hear that egg? The exit! It's that way! Oh my gosh, Test Tube, are you okay? Every way possible! Take it. I realize now Take it. that not even order itself it. can definitively decide the game. Take it. I'm so sorry, Bane Take it. On the show you've already won. Taking part in the action made for easy interaction with friends. Test tube! It's up to you! I can't. <laughs> I've, I've never. I've never athleticized before. A t test tube, that doesn't matter. There is no pattern. The pattern is in you! <laughs> hey! Hey! Excuse me. Yes. Is this yours? Hmm. I must have dropped that earlier. Thank goodness. I've been having a real ant problem. What's this you're working on? Oh, that? It's my time machine. Uh, nope. 
No, you've seen enough, you, you, Jeebweezer. Jeebweezer. Yeah, I like that. I'm gonna use that more. <laughs> I guess I should just start charging admission now, huh? No, Jeepers, it's not ready yet. It, it worked. My time machine worked. Do you know where you've just taken us? No, seriously, tell me. I've, I've never been here before. There's no way this is real grass. Enlightening. Why does everyone look so lifeless and static? Stop! You're deeply confusing a stylistically challenged version of paintbrush. But it's so full circle. No! Thematic parallels be darned! Darned! You can't interfere with the past! You could so much as break a twig here and somehow inadvertently change the few- No. No! It- Wait, is that right? Oh, Gadzooks! Maybe the effects on the present won't be too bad! Ugh, I totally changed it. Something's off about this place. Who's talking right now? Ah! A black hole! I typed in the present, but this is... this. I'm gonna have a breakdown. Ow! Why? You said you were gonna have to break it down. I just wanted to help. I, I, I'm sorry, no. None of you should even exist. This timeline and everything in it is a mistake! No offense. What? So instead of focusing on getting us home, you prefer to mindlessly follow these incoherent ruffians! <sighs> I guess this is where my life's at now. Uh, hi there. Um, can I help you two? You don't say. Wow, when I hear that phrase, it's almost like I'm home! Which I'm not, this isn't my home. Because any emotion or logic disrupts your little celebrity statuses. That's what's going on here, isn't it? What's become of this world? No, no! Wow, this is somehow simultaneously advanced and utterly barbaric! Ah, it's a barrel of laughs here, isn't it? Sorry I tried to repair our problem. I should have just used luck. Or, 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 <coughs> quirks, like you! There it is, nonsensical light bulb, accidentally stumbling into a solution. Oh, you have a crab, we all like you now. Quirkity do, gee! You know, I actually have to try! Actually, come to think of it, salt's the evident leader. Pepper's just the parasite. Oh my golly gee. We need to go. Quick, let's fix this! Oh, this? No, not again! Huh, well I'll be. Maybe, maybe there is a method to your madness. Light bulb, quirkity don't say that. I was wrong. You don't stumble into solutions, you recognize them. After all, logic needs chaos too. Fact, it needs it right now. Great Scott, that's us! Ugh, I totally jinxed it. Oh my golly, what is that? That's the Venomous Baxtrus Hyperbolica! Oh yes, highly radioactive! Say, couldn't we have come back sooner? No time to nitpick! Draw something abstract! Too dangerous! And not my fault the mission was disrupted. But, I did have fun. Fun with no answers? You sure you're not a test tube from an alternate timeline? <laughs> That's not logic or chaos. That's just... Being a jeebweezer? Yes! Corn! Uh, corn! I... saw something. A, a vision. It... It felt so real. Sorry, you see them too? <gasps> the facilities, the screen protectors, golly gee, it felt like I was there! Hey, uh, need a hand? Oh, oh, g golly! Sorry, sorry, Kali. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> have you ever tried using a tranquilizing tracking dart blaster? Ha, <laughs> it worked! This way! None of those would have fixed it. You don't think so? <sighs> Baseball, recently, I made my own timeline. Yep. And it went haywire. You know, light bulb. But she showed me that the unpredictable can happen in experiments. Things blow up. I learned, and now I don't repeat those patterns. Wait a minute. Fan, have you two just been sitting around? What? Uh, look, if we follow. Oh, so it's we now. <sighs> Let's go. <gasps> I've saved it, I've run tests on it, and I know what it needs to survive! Oh, you're, oh, you you'll can't save be trusted it. with I, this! I've been the I'm... I'm sorry, fan. So, what if it made a noise? So, everything! Gee, have you ever studied an incubated species capable of exponentially amplifying noises prior to emergence? 
We can't do anything, but I prepared. Oh, I'm not so angry. I'm furious. But do you know how productive anger can make you? I'm riding the wave here. We can't let them get away. That won't hold for long. We still need to find a way up there. Uh... What? Your secret lab. I meant your secret lab. Well, holly gosh golly willikers, Mike. I wish this was under better circumstances. You did it. You all did it. The secret is out. In in your hearts. Take it. Take everything in the lab. Whatever Mike hasn't already stolen. <sighs> golly. <laughs> That's it. We got our parts right here. Fan was taken by none other than Cobbs. That makes us angry, right? Yeah, I thought so. So let's channel that anger and save him. Who's with me? Case, are you going to keep sitting there? Well, you are the reason he was eliminated. So the egg is none of your concern. Did you even hear what she said? Ridiculous. Explain how I'm the villain for doing what was right. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Dustube. Golly! See, that that was you. That's you. Okay, come on, I didn't smash anything. Look at all the damage you just caused. Hmm. Huh. Thanks. Now get me some tape for this. This looks awful. We're almost there, buddy. We're done! The ship is built for one pilot. Couldn't you have built one to fit all of us? Yes, but I didn't. Now we just have to decide who it's me and I'm going, and I don't want any ifs, ands, or buts. Sure, just do it. Makes sense. You built it and you're qualified, right? Uh, yes. This is important to me. Fan, stand back! Where's the egg? Oh, golly. What are you? Whoa. <clears throat> I, uh, got something for you. It's pretty broken, but I'm hopeful that we can fix it. Would you happen to know where the other lost one might be? No, I I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. No, no. Testube, don't. You aren't responsible for this. Cobbs is Cobbs the stole them, you stole them, I stole them. They never belonged to any of us. He felt like mine. I know. But they belong to this family. You think you can say goodbye? How did I get here? What happened? Where's the ship? Where's Fan? Oh. On the contrary, there was no Cobbs. I encountered an alien species, not Microphone, who actually used no teamwork when she obliterated me. Did you see her do that? Well, no, but I'm also not an idiot. I, I hope it was worth it. Test him. I'm sorry. You're brilliant. It it wasn't an easy decision. I get it. It's a game. Did the voice in your head tell you to do it? You're a threat to my game. Nothing personal. Better walk in front of me, Mike. I don't want you stabbing me in the back again. <gasps> I wasn't sure if I'd ever see you again. And be able to tell you, I'm sorry. Everyone thinks I'm this brainiac, but clearly I still have a lot to learn. What I did to you was really cold, and I'm worried that things won't be the same. Yeah, things will be different. But that's okay, because we got it. And you know what? I think they do too. <laughs> Stir up some chaos for me. Oh, neato to the third degree, yin-yang. But, uh, what are you fishing for? Why would it be in the water? I threw it in there. Yep, okay. The mother load! <laughs> oh, Box, who taught you how to swim? And even Box's generosity wasn't the catalyst. Fascinating. Um, hey, balloon! Uh, I think this equation has an answer! Now this equation may as well be divided by zero! There's no solution! Oh, wait, actually, there would be an infinite number of solutions. Oh, uh, good, okay. Ah! Bravo! Bravo! Oh, ow, ow, ah. Wow, a one in eight shot of winning the grand prize? The odds have never been greater of victory. Um, no, it'd be one in nine with you here.
Oh, also, you're not dead? That's interesting. Ooh, I like this one. Hmm, let's see. I can tell you my internal dimensions if that's what you're trying to calculate. Being told the information? <laughs> what is, what fun is that? We're gathered here to remember our dear friend Bodhi, the truly unforgettable vessel that brought us into this strange new competition. Yang has prepared a few words. Of course, of course. That was a beautiful service test tube. Thank you, fan. Oh, did you also prepare a eulogy? <gasps> fan! Invasion of privacy! Fine. <gasps> what? Is it bad, or, or are you just lost in thought while reading? This file is, is impeccable. There's so many notes. No, Fan, don't. We, we don't know what she's capable of. We'll make sure to ask next time. Right, Fan? Oh, well... Thanks! Test tubes, he literally didn't enter anything. Test tube, you are very well versed within the areas of science, but I haven't logged you participating in any other areas. Fan's discomposure is understandable. Even I'm not feeling up to par today, but Cabby's just got so many notes! How do I compete with that? Actually, just one quick thing. I promise I will, when the time is right. Oh, I'm good. <laughs> you know, I can think for myself. You've sure learned a lot from those files, huh? Stay back! I don't want to have to use this! Seriously, I prefer analog. Test tube, look out! <gasps> Whoa! Thanks! Way to bury the lead! Anywho, if we're gonna win this, we need to know the source bots on all of our targets. The best resource for that would be... Your intel, Cabby. Holly, gosh! That's a ridiculous sentiment me phone might actually agree with! After them! <laughs> Just as scared as you said he'd be. Yeah, the night was kind of a blur for all of us. Bo, for the last time, there's no such thing as an elef- Whoa. Whoa. Um, uh, volcano, actually. <laughs> Unfortunately for my studies, it's been dormant. All right, so this is Structural Engineering 101. Let's get this started with a simple length with height measurement for volume calculations, and then we- oh, oh. I hate to push in on such educated thinking, but maybe it's best we perhaps let fate intervene. Fate? Also, don't lie, you clearly enjoy pushing in. Well, thank you for that very carefully crafted observation, but I am not relying on otherworldly forces again. Uh, um, I'm not following. Look, here we go. Hoo-wee, looking neato, team. <laughs> Sorry, test tube. <sighs> I can't take you seriously still looking like that. Thanks! Hey, Cabby! C can you remind me what the melting temperature of plastic is? My clumsy self always forgets. Oh, so you want to sabotage us now, huh? Way to be a snollygoster! Snollygoster? <gasps> How crude! Withhold information! We need to work together as a unit or we'll ruin! Do you guys want to flip those frills? Get your paws off me! I'll be frank. I'm concerned. Argue anymore. Please, it's not worth it. Well, maybe it is. Especially when some people have had a bad history of protecting eggs. <laughs> well, the only one who will need protecting is you at the Vultimai! Yay, yay, yay! Box spared his own life to save Clover. The hammer was headed straight towards her head. He's truly a hero. And it's all my fault. And Gabby's. I'm still stuck with... Oh, hey, Tester. Oh, hi. You need my help? Huh, wow. I, um... I know, I know, but look, I like you, and if we can work it out, we can make it far together. I promise, for the sake of the game, Smart Alliance? Yeah, yeah, okay. We've both been pretty petty, but I think we can make this work. Tell me, Testu, between Silver and Painty, who is the taller one? Uh, says here it's Silver. What was that about? Hey, Gabby! Uh, why don't you run things over here while I take, um, Bo to get some more ice cream? I could gather some intel? I thought you were banned. Well, maybe I could help you out of this pickle. Hey, I'm sorry about that whole box tragedy. I can't fix what happened. There's only so many problems that can be solved with simple equations, but there's so many more that have impossible, unspeakable solutions. But I want to solve them anyway. Well, hey, hack this table and I'll consider it even. So, um, you liking your new team? Well, that should do it. The ban is lifted. Oh, uh, while I'm at it, strawberry ice cream! OMG, the best kind! Thanks. And, hey, do me another favor, will ya? Just, would you look after Balloon? Sure, but I, I thought you two hated each other. Well, not anymore. Hey, everything all right? Do Cabby and I agree on everything? Of course not. 
Not even Fan and I agreed on everything. But I wish there was just one thing. Then maybe it wouldn't be a problem. So silver's the obvious pick then. Let's do it. Figures. Won't miss him. Okay, let's do this together. I'll go press the button. I need you to use this information and convince the others. Can I trust you to do that? For sure. Um, but wait, what about your files? You can hold on to them. You've proven to have some great insight of your own and I value that a lot, Test Tube. If I didn't solve the problem, then who would? You did this. Look, b before you- We could have gone so far. Why? Why? We know what you've been writing, Cabby, about all of our flaws just so you could take us down. Because you expect everyone to act exactly how you write them to be. Sure, right now I'm a convenient ally, but tomorrow I might not be so convenient and I'll be next, right? That's what you did to Fan. That's what you do to them. To me. That was not my intention. It's to keep history, your history, alive. Well, now, your history. I got it! Ah! Well, golly gee, I can only speak for myself, but I for one have never felt better! First round is Test Tube versus Clover. Hey, Test Tube, think of a number! Uh, okay. Was it six? It was not. Oh, okay. That was amazing! The luck, it, it just happened. I didn't even have to think about it. Hey, what's wrong? But you're so smart, maybe you can read it? Gollickers, that's odd. I looked at this file before and I didn't see anything blot. <laughs> Whoa, Nelly! Test tube, why'd you save my life earlier? But, because I had to. Because you had to. You knew me phone couldn't bring me back. You knew I came back a different way. A way you didn't want me to know. That is why your luck burnt my file. I do. Bo, please, just let me explain. <sighs> Your death was a tragedy, Bo. Fan never accepted it, so neither could I. But with my technical ability and his knowledge of all the things he used to do and say, we saw an opportunity to right a wrong and solve the problem. It wasn't easy, especially since, well, not too long ago, we went through another loss. And we know that they could never come back to us, which is when we realized maybe you could give us someone to care for again. No. Because essentially, you're the same bow they knew and loved. The only difference is that robotic shell you're in now. Yes, I I'm sorry, I've been looking for the right time to- Bo and I aren't the same though. I adjusted the program to block out everything related to how you died. That way, nothing could ever remind you. Please, Bo, Bo just- Shh. I feel it coming to the surface. Couldn't sense it before, but it was always there. What is? Uh are you saying that Bo does have an aura? But how do you know? Well, how do I know that you're test tube? B because because I know. Beautiful, isn't it? Clover, ha have you seen um Hey, you know I'm a real hypocrite. I got so mad at Cabby for expecting everyone to be exactly how she wrote them to be. And here I was, expecting you to be exactly how I programmed you to be. Look, I, I know I can't make up for what I did, but I want to use whatever I can offer to help you be you. Thanks for patching my head up. It'll be nice to see and hear everything clearly now. <laughs> it's the least I could do. So let's the two of us lovely ladies have a chocolate cake with wit. What's wrong? Ugh, are they taking mobile orders first? No, it, it's just chocolate cake was Bo's favorite. I just want to be certain that you want it because because you want it, not because of a string of code I conjured up. Hmm. Hey, this petty nonsense isn't going to get us a winning cartoon. Hmm. Co-writers. Co-writers? Between the cabbie situation and now Bobot, I really need to keep it low profile. So, naturally, I had to be the director. As director, I simply can't contribute. But why don't you two bring what excites you both to the table and find a way to... mesh it together? I am genuinely so proud of all of you. That being said, don't we need, like, a boatload of money? <gasps> Balloon! Oh no, we forgot craft services!
Amazing directing work, Test Tube. You're entirely responsible for today's victory. Ah, hooray! <laughs> I thought it'd never come back. I gave her a catalog of voices and she picked a new one. It's processing as we speak. I thought she'd never come back. Let's... Hey, Test Tube. Wanted to say thanks. I asked her to keep watch over you while you were on the new Pinkers. Thanks for keeping him safe. Of course. Listen, uh, look, I know Cabby is out to get revenge on me. And I could use some numbers. One in. I can probably pull Paintbrush in, too. She can't be serious over there. Giving up her immunity to Silver? The ego on that one. Ugh, she's gone next. We can't vote Cabby. She just came back. Her fault. This is what needs to be done. One vote left. Tenth contestant eliminated from Inanimate Insanity Invitational. Test two. Great job, thinkers forever. Hey, wait. You two played a very strong game. Sorry it had to happen this way. Yeah, no hard feelings. Wait, wait, wait. You two with the good sportsmanship? Why, you just lost the game. This is important to you. Test tube. I, I just- Look, Cabby, we're all just trying our best. Paintbrush here made a new family this season, and you know what? I can respect that. They didn't vote with me, but they also didn't vote for me. Since when did everyone find me so easy to read? I'm still sorry, though. All good. It's great that you care about all of this, but all you've done is make people scared of you. And when you do that, you miss so much. Oh, golly! Do I get to hear your voice before I head out? <clears throat> um, so, how do I sound? Nice, I hope. What? Oh, I love it! There's still so much I haven't found. Hey, even so, all I see and hear now is you. So thank you, because I missed out for too long. <laughs>